ready to open the hood, useful for the tutorials. And for car parts, the right idea is the Mr. Auto app. Easy, fast, and with better prices than on the website. You will find the bog pads used in the video exclusively on the Mr. Auto website and through the link in the description. Turn your engine off, pull up the handbrake, pull on the bonnet release lever and open the bonnet. Open the brake fluid reservoir. In order to change the brake pads on your vehicle, you will have to raise the front of the car and take off the wheels. This will provide you with full access to the brake pads. Loosen the stud bolts on the front wheels, raise the front of the vehicle, and put it in the two axle stands. You will then be able to take off the wheels. Don't forget to slide them under the vehicle. We strongly suggest watching the tutorial, raising your vehicle safely before carrying out this step. Turn the disc outwards, this will facilitate the process. Insert a flathead screwdriver to the outer extremity of the oblong hole located on the front of the brake caliper. Lift it off using the screwdriver as a lever by pulling it towards you. This will then push the piston in. Don't hesitate to push the screwdriver further in once the space between the pad and the caliper allows. Ensure that you have pushed the piston in as far as possible before moving on to the next operation. Using a socket wrench and an E12 female torque socket under the two caliper mounting bolts. Unclip the brake hose. You can now remove the brake caliper and place it on one of the coils of the shock absorbers. Remove the pads. You can slip them off by pushing them away from the disc. Using a wire brush, clean the brake caliper mount around the area where the pads will be placed. This will facilitate their installation. Hello, if this video helps you, like and subscribe. You will find the bulk parts and products used in the video on the Mr. Auto site and in the link in the description. Take the new brake pads. Coat the outside of the new pads with copper grease. Put the fasteners in place. Insert the new pads into the caliper mount, sliding them into place. Put the brake caliper back in place. And screw in the caliper mounting bolts. Don't forget to use the new screws that come with the pack as they have been pre-coated with red locking fluid. Finish off the tightening with the torque wrench. Reclip the brake hose. You can now repeat the operation on the other side. Put the wheels of your vehicle back on and lower it to the ground. Before starting your car, don't forget to screw the brake fluid stopper back in. Be careful. Before using your vehicle again, start your car and pump the brake pedal a few times to bring the brake pads together again. Try to drive smoothly and avoid sudden braking for the first 50 kilometers or so to avoid glazing the new pads. Operation completed. Please support us, subscribe and like the video, that will be really cool.